What I want to do today is connect our Amazon Alexa and Microsoft Team apps so that whenever we give our Amazon Alexa a prompt, a message will automatically be sent out into our selected Microsoft Teams channel. Zapier is a no-code tool that makes it easier for anyone to automate workflows across 5,000 plus apps. If you don't have an account, there's a link in the description for a free two-week trial so you could try it risk-free. Let's dive in. In order to get started with this workflow, I need to create a Zap by clicking the button on the left-hand side of the screen. Because I want Amazon Alexa to trigger a message in Microsoft Teams, I'll need to use Amazon Alexa as my trigger. I can find the app by typing it into the search bar and clicking below. The trigger screen will then pop up. I should click Trigger Phrase Spoken as my event and then click Continue. Setting this as the trigger means that anytime Amazon Alexa receives a spoken prompt from a user, it's going to run this workflow. In order to set up our trigger app's data, we'll need to type in the phrase that we want to trigger our zap. I'm going to type in a custom message. I'll type send a message in Teams. I want my Alexa to respond to my phrase, so I'll type in what would you like to send under the additional prompt question. In order to finish setting up the trigger, we'll need to pull in some example data. Make sure your Amazon app has Bluetooth enabled and then click Test Trigger. You're all set with the first step. Click Continue and we can start creating our first action. Type in Microsoft Teams in the search bar and select it on the drop down menu. Next, click Send Channel Message and click Continue. The first time we set up Microsoft Teams, we'll need to authenticate it with Zapier. A link will pop up for you to log into your Microsoft Work account. Don't worry, it's totally safe because Zapier uses industry standards for encryption when connecting with each of your apps. I'll put a link to Zapier's security and trust page in the description as well. By the way, if at any point you get stuck, Zapier's got an amazing support team that can help you out. There's a link in the description to their forum post for this specific workflow. Click Continue, and it's time to assign our Trigger Apps data into the Action Apps fields. Before we can fill anything out, we'll need to connect the Zapier app with our selected team channel. To do that, open your Microsoft Team apps and click the Apps button on the left-hand side of the screen. Once I'm there, I'll type in Zapier, I'll click the app, and then I'll click Add. Next, go back to the app screen once more. Click on the Zapier app once more, and then click Add a Team to add a team under the app's drop-down menu. Once that's complete, select the channel that you want Zapier to send your messages in. Great, now you're ready to set up your action. Go back to the action page and under Teams, click the team you wanna use for your Zap. I'm going to click Zapier Productions. From there, select the channel that you would like your messages that you sent from Amazon Alexa to appear on. Next, under the message text, click your prompt that you typed into the trigger step. Mine said, what would you like to send? So I'll click that and then I'll click continue. Click test action and I should be all set. Yep, there it is. This is ready to turn on. Now, anytime we create a voice prompt to our Amazon Alexa, a message will automatically be sent out into our selected Microsoft team channel. I hope this was a helpful demo. Zapier can do so much more with these two apps and thousands of others. Check Zapier out. There's a free trial. Click the link in the description.